Hi, this is Elaine Starling, and I want to talk to you about leadership. In particular, how you as the leader can very quickly identify the hidden needs of the person that you're speaking to. You know, this is so incredibly vital as a skill for you as a leader because people really need your help. It doesn't matter if you're talking to someone in your office, you're talking to a prospect or a client. These folks really want your help, but they don't always know exactly what their problem is. They don't always understand truly what they need. And even if they do have a pretty good idea of what they really are looking for, sometimes they have trouble articulating what that is in a clear, concise way so that you know right away exactly how you can help them solve their problem. So I want to invite you to read a fabulous book. It's called The Coaching Habit, written by a great Australian guy named Michael Bungay Stanier. He's identified seven different questions that allow you to very quickly get your clients, your prospects, and your team members to clearly communicate exactly what they need. Let's start with the first question. It's called the kickstart question, and this is one that you can use with anybody in every conversation. Ready? What's on your mind? This is an incredibly powerful question to ask. As a matter of fact, marketing guru Jay Abraham identified a very similar question that increased sales results in a retail setting by 40%. Very similar question. The question is, what brought you into the store today? So when you're having a conversation with someone on your team or a prospect or a client, you could ask them, what's on your mind? Well, there are three different areas that they might have a concern. The first is the project, whatever it is they're trying to accomplish. Maybe there's a challenge that they're dealing with and they really are looking for some help. The second area that could be a concern for them are people. They might have issues with their own team members, with other colleagues, or with a different department, or maybe with their own clients. And that's where their, their issue really lies. The third area is with patterns. Those are personal patterns where they're getting in their own way, and they're maybe not showing up as effectively as they could be. So as you drill down into the what's on your mind question, you're listening to hear, is this a project issue, a people issue, or a pattern issue? And when you can help them solve any one of those three areas, you are a miracle worker. So I really encourage you to get a copy of The Coaching Habit by Michael Bungay Stanier. It's truly brilliant. It's very easy to read and simple to apply. There are seven questions, very simple questions, but equally powerful. And he shows all of the neuroscience, all of the scientific discoveries that really support every single one of these questions and why there's such a powerful psychological trigger that helps you understand what the true needs are and how you can get people to buy in and take action to resolve their issue. It just takes a little bit of practice and you can hone your leadership skills to quickly identify hidden needs.